Hello, and welcome back to my channel. Today, I'm excited to show you a fantastic tool called Adobe's Generative Fill AI that allows you to effortlessly edit your photos without the need to download or use Adobe Photoshop. So, let's dive right in. To access the Adobe Generative Fill AI feature, simply visit the Adobe Firefly AI page and locate the Generative Fill section. There, you'll find a Generate button. Click on it to proceed. Next, click on the Upload Image option and select the photo you wish to edit. Now let's explore how we can use Generative Fill AI to change the background of our image. To remove the current background, click on the Background button. Describe the desired background in the prompt input and click Generate to initiate the process. Adobe Firefly AI will provide you with four different options to choose from. Once you're satisfied with the result, click on the Download button in the top right corner to save your edited image. If you aren't pleased with the outcomes, you can click on the More button to generate additional options. To finalize your current edit, click on the Keep button. Alternatively, if you want to start afresh, click on Cancel to create a new prompt. Now, let's proceed to editing the dress within the photo. To start, locate and click on the Remove button situated on the left side of the interface. If necessary, adjust the brush size by clicking on the Settings button to ensure precision. Carefully remove the current dress from the image by using the brush tool. Once you have successfully removed the dress, click on the Insert button. In the prompt menu that appears, enter your instruction for the generative fill command. Specify that you want the AI to generate a white dress to replace the previous color. This will guide the AI in generating the desired white dress and seamlessly integrating it into the photo. But wait, there's more. We can also add new objects to our photo using Adobe's Generative Fill AI. Start by clicking on the Remove button once again. Choose the appropriate brush size from the Settings menu. Begin removing areas in the photo, ensuring that the shape you create matches the object you want to add. After creating the desired shape, Click on Insert to access the prompt menu and type in your instruction for the Generative Fill AI. Once you're ready, hit Generate to add the new object to your photo. I hope you found this tutorial helpful and are as excited as I am about the possibilities of Adobe's Generative Fill AI. Don't forget to like and subscribe to my channel for more amazing content. Stay tuned for the next video, and until then, happy editing.